All right, guys, welcome back. Uh, we're gonna do something cool, I think. I want to, we've been talking about this a lot, like the difference in hunting nowadays and hunting when I was 13, 14, when I like really fell in love with hunting, right? Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go all retro. We're gonna buy everything old. I'm gonna go on eBay because you can't find the switchback. I'm gonna buy Matthew's switchback. I'm gonna get everything old. Uh, stuff I would have shot when I was like early teenage years. Um, we're gonna go to my place in Mississippi. We're not gonna use trail cameras. Uh, we're not gonna do anything. We're gonna hunt off sign in the woods and we're gonna try to kill a big buck, old school with an old Matthew switchback. And honestly, I'm pretty excited about it. Now we just gotta find one on eBay and uh, hopefully get it if we can find one. That's the next step. I got one minute left on this. Um, we're actually getting ready to shoot a podcast, but I'm trying to win this bid on eBay on this old switchback. It's a Matthew switchback, right-handed, 60 pounds, 30 inch. And incredibly, they're hard to find. So I'm on eBay. I got 52 seconds if somebody outbids me. I swear there's 31 people bidding on this bow right now. So come on. I'll increase max bid if I have to. 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five, 34 people bidding, it's up to 430s. Two, one second, zero seconds. I have the ring of death, I don't know what that means yet. Congratulations, you won. 430 bucks for a new switchback, or an old switchback. That's like a 07, that's not the XT, that's the original switch bag so now we got to build it when i get it in and go kill something with it it's gonna be cool i'm excited all right now i just gotta confirm and pay guys it's in i think this is the switch back i won the bid on ebay been waiting on it to come in in the meantime i have contacted all the companies i work with so um we have like one of the first working armor tech from excel same thing from QAD, one of the first working ultra rests. I've got the old Little Goose from Scott, which is what I used to use, used it my whole life. And obviously I had to call Matthews, get new strings and cables for this thing because I have no idea what condition we're in. Um, I'm gonna shoot an old gold tip, like a regular 246 with big veins. So just trying to go back to the early 2000 mode, but I'm gonna get this thing out of the box real quick. I cannot wait to hold this thing, because it has been forever since I held a switchback in my hand. One of the best bows ever, in my opinion. I see it. Good Lord. All right, we got a whisker biscuit on this thing, which takes me way back. Kisser buttons, the stiffest knocking loop of all time. It's put on backwards. String actually looks like it's in good shape though, man. I'm scared to pull this thing back, but still got the old grip. We gotta get this thing tuned up. Try to get it sided in. Slow. Slow, I can't believe it. that's what we used to do. That's what we used to do, guys, I don't know. We've come a long way, come a long way, but we're gonna go try to kill a deer with it. We gotta side it in and Hopefully we can get it to group. It'll be the test. I'm fine with everything else, but if it don't shoot, I ain't gonna like it. I just guessed on my pin gap here, so let's see if I remembered right. 46, let's go. See the old mule deer in the weeds? 50. See if we got the 50 yarder right. Perfect. Woo! That's it, guys. Got the bow in, got it set up, everything's dialed in, slower than Christmas, but still pretty accurate. We're going to probably max it out at 
I don't. I want to shoot one like top pin and less. That's what we're going to try to do. All old school stuff. Honestly, I'm pretty excited. Now it's time to go kill a big buck. We are in Mississippi for Thanksgiving, and it is time to put my money where my mouth is. Um, we're trying to kill a big buck with this thing. <laughs> old switchback i did do since we left off i all i did was change the vein configuration on my arrows uh wasn't really liking the arrow flight i was getting uh so i changed that and got it tuned but other than that we haven't changed the dang thing and uh we're gonna try to kill a big old southern buck old school style everything old right here in mississippi only thing ain't old is our rental it's brand new and I don't like it. It's about to get ruined. But we're going to try to kill a big buck. Let's hope this thing is still sided in. Dead, son. <laughs> Dead. Everything's slower than me when I was in the fifth grade, son. <laughs> <laughs>
the sun's just popping out here in Mississippi. We already had one of our shooters come by. Big deer that almost killed in here last year. Literally took the same trail. Except this year he doesn't have a bunch of does. But right now he's looking for them. Anyway, that's a deer, one of the deer I was hoping to see in here. It just skirted us about 75 yards in the thick stuff. I really hope that he ends up back here this morning sometime, or another big one, but that's the one I've been thinking about. It's good to see him, though, up on his feet. It's cold this morning. Low 30s. Just wish his wind would pick up a little bit. But it's already been a good one. first started using them. Inch and three quarter cut. I knew they liked to have been using my two inch, but we went old school, so it blew through him. There he is, yeah. He poured the blood, dude. Oh, guys. If that ain't a Mississippi River buck right there, I don't know what is. Just heavy, tall, eight-pointer. 
No brown on this side. Actually, not an eight pointer, seven pointer. He didn't break it off, he just didn't throw it. What a morning. We hadn't been doing anything with cameras. Just finding sign, old school, switch back, everything old. And uh, it's hard because you don't know what you're hunting exactly. But it's also so much fun. But we're gonna hang her up. <laughs> I need to get my lift back out and uh, feel confident again. If you like what we're doing on YouTube, don't forget to hit subscribe. We sure appreciate it. Gonna be seeing a lot more stuff on here and I, you won't watch the smile on my face today. This is a cool product.